hi all of you in part 4 of our uh, molecular docking using autodock 4.2.6 we are going to prepare ligand for preparing ligand we need to have ligand in our system the sources of ligands can be of two types the first one or the online databases here i have mentioned their sources too like pubchem ChemSpider, Drug Bank, eMolecule, SciFinder. You can download your ligands from any of these databases. If not, you can create your own databases by using ChemDraw, ChemSketch, or many other softwares by installing them in your uh, PC. Here, I am going to show you a few of them. This is one of the online chemical database where you can find a number of ligands. For example, in this chem spider, I am going to search for Vin Christian. I am going to take 3D structure. Once the structure was loaded, we are going to save this. So the 3D structure was downloaded in mole format. And now we are going to see this here. And this is an MDL mole format. We have to convert this into PDB format so that our uh, Autodoc can read this. So now we are going to open this in Discovery Studio. If you click this arrow mark, you can see the structure. This is the 3D structure. And now I'm going to save this as WinCristin in PDB format. So now my ligand is ready in PDB format. If once our ligand is ready in PDB format. Now we are going to prepare our ligand for docking. For which we should go to file and read molecule. Select WinCristin, which we have saved that in PDB format. Open. Here you can see the ligand was added in green color. And next step, go to ligand, input, choose. Select WinCristin and select molecule for autodoc. So, next go to edit hydrogen and add hydrogen polar only add and now again go to edit charges compute guest care and some quantity of charges will be added and now go to ligand torsion tree detect root here you can see the root carbon has been highlighted in green color ball now again go to ligand torsion tree set number of torsions the maximum number of torsions possible is 13 for this molecule it was set at 13 and you can see that uh, which bonds are flexible you can see those were highlighted here out of 32, only 13 bonds were uh, rotatable. And, and the last, go to output and save as PDB QT. And when Christian, the extension is dot PDB QT. Save. So with this, we have complete operation of our ligand. By the end of this tutorial, your final folder should have WinCristin in PDB QT format, WinCristin in PDB format, and the ligand what we have downloaded directly in MDL MOL format. So, with this, we have completed our ligand preparation. Our next tutorial will be on preparation or generation of grid parameter file.